good everybody it is your boy cap back with another xenoverse 2 major update for you guys we have the new v jump leaks coming in today and it is something major that i feel a lot of people in the xenoverse community are going to like without doubt now before we get into it want to give a shout out to the homie rio kutya 837 on twitter this is the man slash person who be sharing all the leaks guys he's the one who puts them all out for the community so if you do want to give him a follow be sure to do so now getting into this there's not much information here but as you guys see new article dragon ball xenoverse 2 topo destruction god mode is now available so we are getting god of destruction topo in dlc pack 12 who's honestly one of the characters that i thought had a really good chance of happening just because really nobody besides like a super cow ken goku would have made sense with PyCon. And then really after that, you just think about the characters that the community has wanted most and ones that would be like most popular and wanted in the game, I guess you could say. And Topo is right there at the top of the list. People have been talking about this man literally since the Tournament of Power has come out and we are finally getting him and not only getting Topo, but in the God of Destruction version, which I'm absolutely hyped for because I would much rather prefer the God of Destruction Topo as opposed to the regular one. Now, if they would have done a one where he actually transformed, that would have been the best possible scenario in my opinion but with how xenoverse does dlc characters they've never really had a transforming one like that i mean you think about how many opportunities they've had for rose super saiyan blue vegeto god vegeta blue evolution vegeta so on and so forth there's just so many characters that all come in their fully transformed state and topo is going to be another one now i will say there is a chance guys for a potential another dlc character to come in dlc 12 and here's why we have at least two months until this dlc comes out it has been slated for spring of this year spring doesn't start to like mid-march or something along those lines which is two months away from now so we most likely will see two more scans on this dlc one for february and one for march on this dlc and that gives the chance of another character being confirmed if we have that many more v jump scans to get now am i saying it's going to happen for sure absolutely not but it is something that is possible and with topo now being made a character dispo is very very possible as well so again that is something that can happen we have to wait for future v jump scans to come to really confirm or deconfirm something like that but let me know what you guys think about this man the homie topo is finally coming to xenoverse 2 and he's coming in dlc 12 let me know your thoughts on that down below in the comments but as always thank you guys so much for watching hope you guys enjoyed this video until next time hope you have a good day hey y'all